So does he how are you feeling after that straight through to your final? Yeah, good. Um, I was really pleased just to kind of get out there, start racing. Seems like it's been a long time coming. Um, and yeah, I wanted to get straight through to kind of try and miss the semi. So yeah, job done. Yeah, you had a great World Championships last year as well. So you look, have you got any targets for, for this competition? Uh, no, not really. I mean, I just wanted to get to the final and see where you end up. You know, it's going to be nine fast people in the final, so it could be anyone's race. Yeah, so just concentrate on this year, I think. <laughs> Great. And how are you feeling building up to this competition? Um, pretty good. I haven't really done much, um, many thousands this year. I seem to have raced quite a lot of other stuff, but not the thousands. So, you know, I was looking forward to getting back out there, giving that a go again. And yeah, it's good. You've got your 5k as well to look forward to. So how are you, look, how are you feeling juggling both uh, events? Um, I mean the workload is fine really, it's a lot of heat and then the final and then um, five games Sunday so it's you know much less than I'm doing training so kind of workload wise it'll be fine. Um, yeah it's just about kind of trying to think about the next race only and not look too far ahead to the 5k. Sure. And what are you going to do to prepare for that next uh, final? Uh, so finals on Saturday so uh, nothing special, I'll come down here tomorrow have a little paddle around um, but other than that just yeah stay reasonably active without getting too uh, too tired or staying in the sun too long.